or unknowns battlegrounds arrives on xbox one today and with it comes a novel new control scheme it takes some getting used to so here's the basics to get you started battlegrounds is a fairly sophisticated tactical shooter and includes controls for leaning around corners and changing the range of your weapon the controller maps were posted to the official xbox blog not long ago but they don't do a good job of actually telling you what's going on. Let's start with picking up items and equipping attachments. To grab something off the ground, simply walk up to it and point your reticle at it. Press X and it enters your inventory. Weapons will automatically equip to one of three slots. Either primary weapon, secondary weapon or pistol. In the gallery below, I've stumbled across a cache including an AKM a compensator and some ammunition. To pick them all up, just spam X while moving the cursor around. To load a weapon, hold down X. To switch between multiple weapons, hit Y. To equip an attachment, you'll first need to go into your inventory by hitting the menu button. Once there, you'll notice that the screen is divided into a series of vertical columns. The first column to the left is highlighted by default and represents the items on the ground. To move them from the ground to your personal inventory, hit the right shoulder button. Then use the D-pad to scroll through and highlight individual items. Just select the attachment you want and hit A. Then A again to attach it. Once you have more weapons in your inventory, this will be slightly more complicated. A red dot sight can fit onto a primary weapon, a secondary weapon or a pistol. You'll need to use the D-pad to select the correct weapon before hitting A to attach it. To switch between your primary, secondary, pistol and melee weapons, use the Y button. Primary and secondary weapons are interchangeable. To replace a primary weapon with a weapon on the ground, equip your primary and then pick up the new gun. The old gun will fall to the ground. Same goes for your secondary. The D-pad has a bunch of different functions. Pushing up will equip your melee weapon. Pushing right will switch between different types of grenades. Tapping down allows you to switch between medical supplies. While holding down uses them. Left changes the firing mode of your current weapon. If there are multiple fire modes, once you have a ranged weapon, Tap the left trigger to toggle into the aiming down sights mode. This will allow you to use your scope. If you have one equipped, up and down on the D-pad will adjust your range. Once aiming down sights, hold down the left bumper to hold your breath. Switch between first person and third person with the right bumper. First person is especially useful for close and fighting inside buildings. That's because in battlegrounds, Bullets travel directly from a weapon's muzzle. If the end of your rifle is tucked behind a window sill, you're not going to hit your target. Switching to first-person perspective gives you a better idea if there's anything blocking your 